Hello everybody, my name is Fryjato30 and welcome back to Cutlet Review. I know it's been a while, but um, I haven't got a chance to do it because I have to do React every single day. So, sorry for the lack of videos and why I didn't post this so long ago. But uh, yeah, so we're here to review Amazing Spider-Man issue 16. I already got issue 17, 18 and 19 in the mail, so I have to review a lot of comics. And yeah, so I think we should just um, yeah start the review. So before watching this video, I just want to tell you that uh, go watch the other comic reviews. Otherwise, you're going to be confused with what's happening. So yeah, so if you know what's been happening, then welcome back. So we're here with uh, Spider Verse Part Four of Seven. So let's just start, Sally. So, the story starts off with a Spider-Woman story, not a Spider-Verse story, well, it is a Spider-Verse time, but if you remember last time from Spider-Woman, which I think uh, you already know, so yeah, so Spider-Woman ended up in uh, the world of Zero Zero, which is the homeland of uh, the Inheritors, and she is very confused on where she is, and then she gets captured, and uh, Yes, this guy tells her that, uh, you know, you're a captain and stuff like that, and we see the other version of, uh, of Spider-Woman, and then this kid gives him a present, and then Spider-Woman's like, ignore him, and yes, yeah, so, and then we, the Spider-Woman we know is on the ship with the pirates, and yeah, she's off. And then we see Silk, you know, she's grown, go, grow, going through dimension and dimension, and then, yeah, the one of the inheritor comes to kill her, <coughs> and then she just escapes. Yeah. And then we see Spy Woman talks, or, yeah, the other one, and then Spy Woman sees that. And, uh, yeah, so, um, then all of a sudden, Seal comes out of nowhere and then she tells Spider Woman about everything and uh, she doesn't that the Seal doesn't know that th she's talking to this Spider Woman of this universe. And then the Spider Woman we all know now the original one comes and saves Seal and uh, Spider Woman gives Seal uh, the portal so she can go through and then she ends up in. A place where a nuclear bomb has been, and then she start um hosting. That's what we call in, in Norwegian. And then the inheritors comes, and then they start. They can't breathe. So um, yeah. So Silk <coughs> is there stuck, and uh, this is the only pa place the inheritors can't go. This dimension. So Silk knows what she is doing now, <coughs> and then we see Spider Woman. You know. She's kneeling for Mullen, and then she Mullen gives him a kiss, and then it says continue to the next picture. Now we go over to the <coughs> real Spyro story. So if you remember last time, um, we found out that the, the baby is the... Oh, what is it called? The, I, I don't remember. Tell me in the comments below what it is again. And then, and then we also remember that... Um, um, what is it called? What is he called again? Um, oh, what is he called again? Um, I'm just going to call him more than his father. I'm this guy, and uh, we he killed Cosmic Spider-Man in the last issue, and then some Spider-Man tries to stop him, but that doesn't work because he's bad. And then Spider-Girl tries to save her, his or her brother, but that doesn't work at all, and. Uh, yeah, Spargo gets mad. Then Spider-Man comes back from the comfort from uh, the talking with Spider-Woman in the last issue, if you remember. And then all of a sudden, this Transformer Spider-Man comes out of nowhere. And then, yeah, we have a Japanese Spider-Man. If you don't know who this is, he's from a cartoon long ago. And yeah, it's, it's cool to throw that in. But, and then we get this in, if you remember. And the inheritors can't go through this dimension because it's radioactive, so yeah. But then Shilk just spins her off with a costume she goes. And uh, since the safe zone is uh, destroyed, 
and the Spider-Man needs to find another place to hide from them. And then, you know, the Japanese Spider-Man comes back, and uh, the robot didn't survive. And then we see Spider-Woman, you know, she's going to talk to the Spider-King, and then Spider-Man talks to Miles Morales, and uh, yeah, they're in the trouble, and uh, Miles Morales and the Spider-Man from this next day, they're rescuing some other Spider-Man. And then Spider-Man talks to Spider-Man 2099, and uh, yeah, they're doing an operation on the dead... Um, and Demos body so they can see and um, and they can see how they live and stuff like that and then <clears throat> um, once the inheritors call Spider-Man uh, he tells Spider-Man that they know where they are because they can watch them so there's no place for the spider to hide from them because they know where they are and then a bunch of villains and then uh, inheritor comes in and then they do this epic fight and then we go over to Spider Woman. This Spider King gives him or her to some something, and uh, yeah, and Morlin is like wondering what Spider Woman has in her back, and she has nothing. And she teleported the things to Spider Man. So yeah, so Spider Man needs to figure out what it is, and then they go to another dimension, and then yeah, so. Uh, they don't know where they are, and uh, yeah, they're following the 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 way, and uh, yeah, and then they see Silk, all the Spider-Man, but they also see Uncle Ben. Dun 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 That's right, it's Uncle Ben, and it says continue the next issue, so you have to find out the next issue. And then we we'll go to another story with um, yeah, Moon fighting as as Spider-Man from a universe from a video game, and then Warden wins, and then this kid is like, "What the fuck just happened?" And now we go to the other story with uh, Spider Gwen and trying to rescue this Spider-Man, Spider-Man from this universe, and yeah, and um, you know, we found out that this Godling is actually Peter Parker, and uh, yeah, and then. Spider Gwen just shows who she really is, and there's uh, Peter Parker from this universe. Like, no, you die. So we found out that this universe, this Spider-Man from this universe, he he didn't um, forget about the death of Gwen Station, you know. So he killed Green Goblin, then he had to take off the Spider-Man costume, and then he became Goblin. And all of a sudden, um, the inheritors started coming, and. Uh, Spider-Man or Spider-Goblin and sacrifice himself to save um, Spider-Gwen so she can get out. So and that's the story. And now we go to a, a, another weird story with uh, this you know, Spider-Man from this universe. And uh, yeah, he's trying to get away from whatever that thing is. And uh, yeah, he's making lights and stuff like that, and then he goes into this battle and then falls, and then Spider UK finds him and tells him that uh, he needs to come with him because there are inheritors killing Spider-Man, Spider-Man and Spider-Girls from Dimension and Dimension, but this Spider-Man doesn't care and uh, he can't go before he has finished the show, so he puts Spider UK in a sheep costume, and then, yeah, and then, yeah. And then, yeah, this Spar weird Spider-Man joins Spider-UK at last. And then we get to, I think this is the final story. Wait a second, wait a second. Um, no, but uh, we get to another story, and this is the story of Spider-Punk. And he's from a universe where Allspawn has taken control of New York City. And then some punks, or some punks, I'm just going to call them that, are trying to say... New York City from Osborne. and Osborne has um, created the symbiote so that uh, all the policemen are affected with the uh, all with the Venom symbiote Os and Osborne is also infected with the symbiote too so yeah and then all of a sudden Spider-Punk just starts his guitar and just BAM there are they are defeated and uh, yeah Spider-Punk also kills and Osborne so that means they won the fight, and then the VC repair Spider-Man is here to rescue Spider-Punk. And then we go over to a 
to a story that should take place in the future, but whatever. We see the, um, all the Spider-Man fighting the inheritors. If you're wondering where this takes place, this takes place in the next issue or show, so if you're confused, then yeah. And then these two Spider-Men are talking to each other, and then this one Spider-Man is from a universe where he married Mary Jane, and this one Spider-Man is from a universe where he is... Um, Aunt May died, and the yeah, other doing this. So that was the review for Amazing Spider-Man um, issue 18, I think. Yeah, and the next issue looks like this. So yeah, what do you guys think about this? I think it's awesome. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, please leave a like, subscribe, and I will see you in the next video. See you, bye.